Welcome, in front of me is the Huawei P40 Lite E and today I'll show you how to go through the setup process of the device. So when you put up the device for the first time, you will see the screen, the welcoming one. And from here you can choose the language that you want to use. Now I'm gonna stick with English so I'm not gonna change anything here. And once you have selected the language, stop and get started. And stop on region, I'm just gonna keep the one that it is right now. Then you have terms of services, so check right here. You can also read them and use their license agreement. Tap on details, it will give you the entire thing that you're basically agreeing to. You can tap on next. From here you can insert SIM card. Now this step is completely optional and you can completely skip this entirely and insert the SIM card later on after you have set up the device and it will have no difference. So for now I'm gonna skip this. And then you have Wi-Fi connection. So you can connect to Wi-Fi or not, it's also optional. If you do, it will start looking for updates and also give you an option to log in to Google. So you can also uh, restore your device from a backup that you have created, for instance, on an old device. I'm gonna skip this as well for now, so it goes a little bit faster. Then you have protection for your device, so you can set up a fingerprint, face ID, and just a passcode. Um, if you choose either face or fingerprint, you will also have to add the passcode, so keep that in mind. I'm gonna choose to set up a fingerprint, and you can see right here, there's a pin, and you can also change the unlocking method, and you have a choice between four digit uh, pin, uh, basically this one that it is right now, which is way longer, pattern, and password. I'm gonna go with pattern, so let's draw the pattern. Let's do the pattern once more, tap on done. And now I can start scanning my finger on the back sensor. Now when you're doing this you want to get a good read of your entire finger and I'm only doing it to do it as quick as possible. So let's tap on OK once you've finished. Uh, fingerprint ID set and then you also can add your face but I'm gonna skip this. They have uh, enhanced uh, services so you can either set it up, enable all services, or say no thanks. You can also read it to find out exactly what it is. Uh, you have user experience improvement program. Again, some other stuff that basically gathers data on what you're doing on the device, which I'm gonna opt out of. Uh, keep your software up to date. You can enable the, uh, the update. Now I'm gonna set it up to be manual so I can do it later on. And then, data import. Now you can import data from your old device. So you can either do it through the Android, just a stuck one by logging into Google, which will most likely take you back uh, to Wi-Fi connection. Uh, you have also transfer from iPhone or iPad or Huawei, uh, Huawei Cloud Backup, which this one is only for well, the Huawei device. So if you're switching from an old Huawei to a new one, this is the way you could do it, which probably will work the best out of all of them. If you're using some kind of other Android device, then the Android device up the top would be your choice. Now I'm gonna set it up as new, so I'm not gonna really tap on anything here. And once you tap on next, we're now on the home screen. And as you can see, the device is now fully set and ready to be used. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.